Welcome to the Brain 9 First Look Preview. The Brain 9 has been re-engineered from the ground up and provides enhanced capabilities in all aspects of the software. It's faster, more reliable, all new, and there's still more to come. This video tutorial will guide you through some of the fantastic new features. When you install the Brain 9, it will not overwrite your installed version of the Brain 8. So it's perfectly safe to have both versions installed on your computer. After downloading and installing, simply log into the Brain with your current Brain account information. Then create a new Brain 9 from scratch or import an existing Brain 8. And right away, you'll start to notice some of the Brain 9's fantastic new features. Try clicking on an active thought to notice the new Thought Properties dialog, where I can easily rename a thought, add a label, set up thought types, tags, change colors, and even adjust the icon, all from a streamlined interface. I can also Alt-click on a thought that isn't the active thought to modify its properties as well or Alt-click on a link to view or edit its properties. And check out the clean, new design of the Notes area, where the Notes toolbar will only appear when needed for maximum use of screen real estate. And the updated splitter control bar, where I can easily minimize the notes for full view of the Plex, or alternate the view to a vertical layout, whatever best suits my needs. And check out the Brain's flexible new tabbing feature, where I can easily have multiple different brains open at once and easily jump between them with the tab. But let's not stop there. I'd like to open this brain twice. So I can easily focus my attention on different areas of the same brain. But let's take that even one step further. I'll simply pull the tab into a separate floating window for a wonderful side-by-side -side comparison. And at any time, merge the tabs back together. And the Plex in the brain has been greatly enhanced with smoother animations and smart focus, which grays out the surrounding thoughts to bring my attention to the current action. Thought creation has been streamlined Without any additional clutter, I simply type in a thought name and hit enter to create new thoughts. Viewing enhancements for your brain have been added as well. Check out the brain's new mind map view that really allows you to get the big picture on how all of your information fits together. It looks like I've expanded to display too many thoughts on the screen at one time. No worries, I'll use the brain's new slider to easily adjust my current view, and the Brain's new streamlined toolbar makes it easy to access thought types and tags. Let's go back to look at the new content area in more detail. Notice that thoughts with web page attachments actually load the web page in the content window down below, and I can further navigate without ever leaving the Brain. And notice Thoughts with multiple file attachments will feature your first document. And remember, I said there was more to come. Stay tuned for an all new document preview feature. Now let's focus on the Brain 9's completely redesigned notes editor. It's never been easier to create or edit new notes in the Brain. Notes have their own slider as well, and I can take advantage of the Brain's built-in formatting by clicking a paragraph and selecting a new format. And let's add some graphics as well. It's easy to copy and paste images into notes from virtually anywhere. Files, web pages, and links to images are automatically embedded and saved locally. I'll make some quick adjustments for effortless beautiful notes. But it doesn't stop there. I can also paste hyperlinks to other thoughts right in my notes. I'll simply right click on a thought to copy it onto my clipboard and then navigate to another thought. I don't need a direct link visualized in the Plex back to the history thought, but I'd like to reference it here in the notes. 
so I'll simply paste it in. So in the future, I can easily click to navigate to another thought. And to further enhance your notes, try setting up a different note style. You can choose from a modern sleek design to a more classic look. Or try the new dark style, whatever fits your personality. And keep in mind, your notes don't have to be locked in to simple text and graphics. Try adding a video by just dragging and dropping from YouTube right into your notes. From the front end user interface to the back end data storage, literally everything is new and improved in the Brain 9.